Good afternoon, family. Once again, it's your DC dude. If you are already subscribed to this channel, welcome back. However, if you are new to this channel, I recommend that you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can stay in the know about where we're going to go. It's fine afternoon, family. We find ourselves in front of the Martin Luther King Library downtown, Washington, D.C.'s Central Library. DC dude. This is the fourth video you're doing about Martin Luther King Library, man. I mean, you must really like this library. Well, that's an understatement. I actually love this library, right? First of all, it's been my go-to for Washington, D.C. information uh, for years now, right? And secondly is the renovation. It goes beyond a resource now. Like, So since they reopened and did the renovations, uh, there's some things that that are part of this library that were not a part of the library before. First part I want to tell you about is this cafe in the library. So they have a cafe in the library, like a Borders or Barnes and Noble. Never had that before in the public library, right? So that's kind of cool. And it's called Marion's, and it's done by DC Central Kitchen. So it's a cool place to hang out. Bring your laptop in here, sit on the tables and chairs. Kind of cool, right? Nice open space. Or feel free to step out through these doors on the patio and chill out here. This is not a part of the original library as well. It's a part of the outdoor patio space. And so on the other end of the library, where you can use the computers, is basically an art museum with paintings and pictures on the wall. And I'm told these are done by people who are from Washington, D.C. So what y'all think, fam? <laughs> it's not a typical lab. It's, it's cool things to do, cool things to hang out and do. Meanwhile, family, as always, you never know where we're going to end up next. So if you want to ride, just click on subscribe. <laughs>